whatever you think is possible, even though may, it may look overwhelming at the beginning. I think, you know, the programming landscape has obviously changed quite a bit, but for newer developers or even more experienced developers, like what do you think are the most essential skills today that people need to be picking up? In terms of technologies and stuff, I don't know, but... Uh... Maybe even not direct of, yeah. technologies, but like I don't know, some, some softer skills like curiosity. Yeah. That, that's what always kept me going because you're just, just curious. Like, how, why is this the way, this way? And, and also, I know this is a hard one. Um, I just believe that it's possible. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes, because the, we know the imposter syndrome is uh, prevalent in, in our community. Uh, so, like, I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. What's wrong with me? <laughs> that sort of thing. <laughs> Something that I've learned as I grow older is like if you give it time and, and, and you know just keep keep looking at um, how you can do stuff, then it eventually happens. Nothing is impossible. It actually was the same with music when I was because I was self-taught. So I'll try you know some some fast lick on the guitar. Some things work kind of okay quickly. Some of them on, require more time. So I just said, ah, oh, I guess I'm not good enough for that part. Uh, I'll stick with with what what comes you know naturally easier to me. And then, you know, later I realized that, you know, you cannot, you know, shred like Ingrid Mountain in a day, right? But it's still possible. Like if you just, you know, practice the scale slower and all that stuff. So the idea that, that 